Welcome back, one and all, to Red Dead Redemption 2. I am the Dark Seraph, and last time... I, I actually don't quite remember. It's been quite a while since I've been doing some... Since I've done recording. You know, I felt like... Recording today, so here I am recording. I'm now my favorite horse. Let's go, girl. Now, blue car. What do I want to do? Already the fans going. Nice, nice, wonderful, lovely, even. All I know is we're down south towards Rhodes. Molly's got something for me, and the Grays. Let's go talk to Molly back at the camp. I'll cut out the boring stuff. A little speed up. A little music. <clears throat> If I run into anything interesting, I'll just resume. And onward! Oh my god, yes, that's fine. Great even. Someone's fishing camp. Would you look at that? That dog don't never like no one but me. Wanna rest up a while, friend? So what brings you to these parts? Just traveling about. Nothing new, nothing out of the well, ordinary. Well, I'm glad of the company, if I'm honest. The past six months or so, I ain't been around many people. Regular folks, at least. Ain't sure if you heard of a group called the Shalonians? I, I guess you could call it a religion. Obsessed with turtles, which maybe should have struck me stranger sooner. <laughs> yeah, I know of them. I know. You wouldn't believe it. Folk always say I'm too trust. I mean, I don't know you from Adam, and here you are sitting at my fire. Anyway, I more or less handed my life over to them. I met a very persuasive fella in San Denis. Andres, his name was. And he caught me at a bad time. Huh? Hell of a thing, right? It's that I... I've been given over to some poor living, real poor living, kind of behavior the devil himself would be ashamed of. They promised me safety, salvation, paradise. All very appealing to a fellow like me. Well, now. Got to the point where I'd given them every cent I had, and I was ready to fall them off a cliff. I just got out in time. Maybe it was the turtles, or maybe it was just I didn't have the spine to go through with it. Those things are ridiculous <laughs> now, looking back. But things will do for answers, huh? Yeah. Anyway, sorry to ramble on. I should get back to it. Well, have a good time. Well, 
that's not that, that's not my horse. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was the wrong horse. I'm so sorry, dude. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm. Damn it. I was the wrong horse. Well, you don't have a head. Well, I suppose this is just how it goes. It looked like my horse. I'm like, wait a second, this ain't my horse. He's shitting me, he was shooting at me. Hey there, girl. Yeah. Well, Maybe death will bring him salvation, I don't know. Probably got bit by a rattlesnake. There's a legendary effect in Fallout 4 called the N4 Carbine, which takes whatever weapon it drops with and changes it to a 5.56 by 45 millimeter cartridge, which doesn't, it's not a carbine, the 5.56 millimeter is a rifle cartridge. So it's not a carbine, it's a rifle. It's just, it's just a plain old regular rifle. I demand realism in a game with giant killer cockroaches.
Hardest worker in camp. Someone's got to do it. Peace. Whoa. Busy. Bring the black, to, uh, bring the jackrabbit. Oh, fun fact! I think I've said this before, but jackrabbit is actually a fawn. In fact, they can even grow little nubs of antlers. Could really use some good meat for this stew. Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. You're welcome. Just a goddamn minute. Got a lot of back and forth to do here. How do you feel about Duck there, or whatever the hell your name is? to the scraps here now, Mr. Morgan. Good job, I don't Mr. see Morgan. you chipping in. Okay, now let's go talk to the nice lady. Yes, Miss O'Shea. Ah, call me Molly, would you? Oh. Arthur, how is Dutch? I mean, how does he seem to you? I'm about the same as usual, I guess. I really love him, you know. But if he... Like he always says, loyalty is everything, so... Arthur! Excuse me, Miss O'Shea. What you want? I bring a gift. The great gift of information. So you got some tip-up, so now I can yeah. risk my neck and make you some money while you lounge around. You know, Arthur, bitterness, it, it works on the inside as well as on your sour face. If you say so, but you could go find some other fool to run your errands. Bill, come on over here. Will you be my other fool? You too, Charles. <laughs> What are you talking about? Arthur's above a little stick-up I heard about. No, I'm not. You just said. Hey, I'll do it. As long as you ride with us. Well, I got a serious medical condition. <laughs> yes, you are a compulsive liar. No need to be like that. Charles, have I ever lied to you? I hardly know you. Exactly. Now, you boys should do this. It, it's easy, and I'll only take a small commission for my information. But it's now or never. Then it's never. Oh, God help me. <laughs> I like Arthur. Fine. I'll do it. <laughs> well, what is it? It's a supply wagon carrying payroll, but very briefly unguarded, apparently. As it passes through a crossroads near here where there's an old ruined church, it connects 
with the rest of the wagon train. Very easy pickings. As long as we get paid or you get shot, I'm happy. You are a <laughs> sick man, Arthur Morgan. A very sick man indeed. <laughs> okay, you old fucker. Smart Alex. Hold on a second, hold on. How you get wind of this old man? We only been down here all of five minutes. Well, while you boys went off fishing or playing lawman or whatever the hell you've been doing, I've been getting down to business. <laughs> Finding the nearest grog house. Hey, you don't want in on this, Williamson, that's fine by me. Do us all a favor. Head home. Just give it a rest, you two. Just have a little faith for once, will ya? Now, I've been scoping jobs like this since you fellers were knee-high to a grasshopper. Once a decade, maybe. So what is it you scoped here, exactly? Well, I told you. There's a wagon with a lockbox passes through every week. They switch outriders just north of here, but the front wagon's by itself for a stretch before the last run down in the roads. <laughs> I've been watching them. All right, we best hit it quick, Dan. Okay, hold up here. We should cover our faces. Oh, they'll be passing through the crossroads up ahead. When? Soon, Williamson. Christ's sakes. I should be due any time now. Let's keep this quiet and clean. Nobody needs to die here. I want to lose the badge. You see, gentlemen? <laughs> Just like clockwork. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm terribly sorry here yeah, for a second. Just so sorry, so sorry. I thought I was robbing these people. Why would it matter if I attack the wagon? get shot but this is a mistake i work for cornwall kerosene and tar mr leviticus cornwall oh great so you know him <laughs> he doesn't i hear he's rich enough to share the wealth around no he isn't miss it too much oh he'll miss it okay why don't you check out around the back arthur help me out here Inside. Okay, we're looking good. Must be nearly a thousand men. Shit! Hey! Think I say something! Oh, great. Let's go! Arthur, let's go! Yeah! Don't fuck yourself!
money back there. is dead. Using my name. Do not let them in play. You can move fast when you have to, can't you? Just shut up, Williamson. They're still on us. You ain't getting away with this. I'm pretty sure I shot most of them. Dig in, boys. Come on. Quick. Get off the trail. Into the woods. Let's shake him and get back to camp. No, we need to find a place to lie low. We can't risk leading Cornwall's men at camp. All right. Uh, whoa. Let, let, let's hide in here. Quick. Easy. Yeah. Come on. Get out of here. Oh. oh. Yeah, just go on. I'll see you later. All right. Let's get out of sight. We'll stay until dark, and then we'll sneak out of here. Charles, you keep watching now. Sure. Well, we, uh, get some rest. Ugh. All right. <clears throat> Let's try and get out of here. Hey, shit! Absolutely. Well, shut up, old man. Well, look, I was just trying to... Shut up. There's a light over by the house. Damn! Hey, now let's just keep this calm. See what happens. Okay, we got some people in trouble. Is this your place? Kinda. Uh, and you didn't hear nothing? I, 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 why don't you just tell me, partner, what you heard? I, I, tell me what you heard. I don't. I heard some noises out by the barn a while ago. Ain't me. Better not be. All right. Coop forth. Lo, go check out the, the barn. Sir. Come on already. Well, the place looks deserted enough. Sure. You head inside, I'll go around the back. Do not let him close. 
Okay, I just burst into flames. What was I supposed to do there? Hang out in here. Look for my hat. in the same direction. Right through the 
We all still alive? Yeah, just about. Yeah, I'll deal with you later. We got some money, didn't we? Sure, but now we got corn on our backs. It was an honest mistake. I had to leave it, Quan. Get out of here. Every man split up, Quan. Run quick. Good luck, Jens. Stay quiet and move. You know, the second we heard it was Cornwall, we should have said, fuck it, let's go. I'm going to end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Red Dead Redemption 2. As I hopefully get out of... Hopefully Cornwall doesn't track my ass down and string me up. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off.